Yeah, no video yesterday, because obviously I was watching the entire Everfree Northwest livestream. Come on, people. Hey guys, name's Finn. You may notice there's some fake 1080p up the house. I may notice my screen's looking crappy. Yeah, look, looking pretty cra cr crappy. Anyways, yes, there, there, there's some upscaling going on because I, I discovered that it makes better quality on YouTube even to upscale a lower quality source because of the way they do things. So I guess I'll be doing that for, you know, the next while until I can figure out a better solution. Viz more power. Anyway, now to talk about the game. This is apparently Castle Underground Crypt of whatchamacallit. I can't really even remember what it's supposed to be, but it's a Dark Throne. I think that might be supposed to be all one word, maybe. I don't know, but I guess I have to find somebody's tomb in a crypt. Whose could it be? Could it be Frankenstein's? Maybe, maybe Einstein? No, I don't know. I guess I'll find it out soon enough. Well, at least that wasn't marble, but maybe I can read these stones and I'll have the developers' names on it. No, no it won't, but <laughs> I don't think there's anything suspicious about that one, so I'm moving on here. Hmm, what about this? Maybe this could, maybe this could sink into the ground and, and, and turn on a switch or oh, I just don't know. Maybe, hmm, maybe, maybe this shrub has something with it? Maybe I can sort of turn it like, eep, and uh, you know, maybe that would do something. I don't know, man. That, 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 that's a, that's a, that's a door-looking thing. You know, uh, this, I don't know, there's a skull here. That looks special. It's sort of, uh, a guy. Oh, it's a guy. The skull's a guy. You can tell it's not female because skulls are, are shaped like a triangle if they're female, and if they're a male, they're shaped like an actual skull. This is, is really, oh, well, I guess I'll finally try this. Oh, hey, it's a gold ring. So I was right that there wasn't anything here. Well... <laughs> Good for me. Oh, man. Yes, indeed. Sometimes I try to not quick save and quick load a lot, but really it just ends up biting me in the back when I have to load for some reason, even though maybe I don't have to, but oh well. Oh, no! Yes. Well, that's okay. Hey. Right. It's a moss arrow just sticking right on the wall. Like, what? It's... It's like, what? Man, why would you have a moss arrow sticking right in the wall? It just doesn't make any sensicalness. Is that a guy standing there? Well, yes it is, but I don't know how to get past this guy, though. Unless I have an invis, but no, I've got aspirins and vitamins. I could use an aspirin right now, I have kind of a headache, but that's okay. I'm so dedicated to videos that I'll do them even with a headache. This is, this is amazing, I hope you're all amazed. What is this? Warriors from Gates of Hell and Lord Belial, we trust. Still don't know how to pronounce that. Oh well. For some reason, these guys have very limited vision. But I guess when you have no eyes, you might uh, your vision might suffer just a little bit, but not too much because most of seeing is done with your nose, as uh, as everybody is probably aware here. I don't think I'm really saying anything new here. Oh, somebody searching, but. Well, just gonna have to deal with that. Is there finally a door I can- Oh my god, it's there is! I can try picking the lock or finding the right key. Garrett, you are the greatest noob teacher in all of history. Why don't you take your ass back to the original game? Psh! <laughs> anyway. Uh, I didn't hear the click of clicks that time, but I suppose that's just gonna have to do. I don't really think I can feasibly do much to those guys, short of killing them, which is <laughs> pretty final and feasible if you ask me, but they might explode, and, uh, you know, I know they're differently textured than those other guys who explode, but, you know, even still, I don't want to risk it. I warn you, not take up arms against me. Right. Those coffins are metal, because coffins are always metal. They're never wood or anything you'd expect a coffin to be, are they? Fortunately, it looks like I might be able to take this guy out. I guess they have to have some blackjackable guy in a mission when they give you a broomstick right there, eh? <laughs> Alright. Do you, sir, have a name, or are you just a corpse? Well, you're a body, not a corpse. Very different thing. A body may be alive, a corpse definitely isn't. Well, I don't have a key, so great. <laughs> That's fine, I suppose. Oh no! He's coming for me! This is weird. Also, also, 
Yes. Uh, there is, in, in like other unrelated news here that I just remembered, there's this one sort of texture upgrade pack being made for Thief Gold, and it's not out yet. And uh, I was figuring, you know, there was this discussion going on between me and some other dudes on somebody else's video, totally hijacking it, and talking about maybe me doing the original trilogy, and, you know, a few people Some said that... Course, you never know what you're going to into. A few people said they wouldn't mind me seeing me do it, and so I said, okay, well, I'll, I'll think about it, and, uh, but, you know, I figure maybe I should wait till that texture pack comes out to play the first game, so, like, I don't know, this isn't really having anything to do with anything, but just... <laughs> I'm gonna unlock the door with an amulet! Just sort of saying, I know I didn't use textures for SS2, but, you know, I'm inconsistent! So anyways... Ivan, Guardmaster, or Ivan. Ivan, where are you? Lord Kajafas left a message in the library for you. He is very angry. Leave the key of the safe promptly in his office on the usual place! Exclamation mark, exclamation mark, one, 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 two. The Leventy first. Well, anyways... I guess all of a sudden now we're switching to having almost every door be pickable instead of most of them not be, and my crowbar isn't there anymore, which is... Weird, I guess I left it in my room after. <laughs> what? That... <laughs> that door... is constantly being picked and I can't do anything about it. What kind of stupidity is this? Alright, saving and reloading fixed it. That was pretty entertaining, but I think it might have gotten annoying after a while, so hey. I'm sick to death of Lord Kajavas's madness. Day after day, he sinks deeper into insanity. He has changed from being the Lord of the Dark Throne to being a murdering dictator. Last night, he had three villagers abducted and tortured them for no reason. The beliefs of our order are being eroded and we are powerless to stop it. The portal is rusting and our cathedral is falling into ruins. Do portals rust? I thought they just fizzle out. This is the twilight of the gods. The local people are hearing rumors and as they learn more about what is going on in this place, they are become increasingly angry and afraid. One day our secret will be discovered and the authorities will destroy us. We can't allow this to happen. If we are to avoid such a fate, we must overthrow Lord Kajafas. But I fear that I am alone in this belief. What's your secret, dude, that you wet the bed? Because, you know, I won't tell anybody's, but I will still finish the mission, which probably involves killing you all, so... <laughs> I guess you can decide which is the better-ish thing, I suppose. <clears throat> Well, I think I'll be taking to be or not to be. That is the question. The satanic Bible. Wow, looks like he's gotten into some satanic reading. That wasn't a joke, it was just a thing. But still, I guess he read the satanic Bible. He, he read from the Bible black and he can't come back and you got to let him go. And You know, he's seen religion and the light has made him blind. Oh man. Well... That's interesting, I guess. Some potion aspirin thing. Fine. I believe I would not be totally unaware if I'll I stop in for a little light reading. Got a map at some point. Uh, entry number six six six. All Souls Day of sixteen thirteen. I welcome you to my sanctuary, the Dark Throne. My name is Belial, but I have been known by many names. Not too surprising, since in the past I've been an emperor, a strategist, a prisoner, and a priest. Why would the devil choose to be a prisoner when he could be a priest? Pfft. Recent or an emperor. Recently you knew me as the witch, Anna Darvulia, because I am always found where there is need for me. People's fates are already written at the time of their birth, but some I have to show the way so that things end as they are meant to. I think that means people's fates are not written and you're just interfering, but, uh, interesting perspective there. The devil is dumb. Psst. Your fate is the fate of the outcast. You may have been a good wife, mother, hostess, and patriot, but this was not enough for your fellow men. They turned their backs on you. 
humiliated and defiled you. People behave like this when the power of lust overcomes them, and they begin to envy their fellow men. Our case differs from theirs totally. We follow the way of the true ones, yet they call this evil. All people have two faces, a good and an evil, and which prevails is determined by that person's character. I am blamed if the bad wins out, even though I can't ensure the outcome. But you just said you did. Why is this switching character all of a sudden? Why does it say we when it used to say I? What? I was there when the first man was born, and I am there when they die one after the other, but only the chosen few come into my protection, and you are one of these rare beings. I recently took Dracula into my patronage, but he turned from the road, losing his hope. I must still care about what happens to him now, as I have big plans for him, so I may not welcome you personally because of this. You will be my servant henceforth. My servant, as others served you because this was your choice. You had no other, although you are still a living person. You are on the road to immortality, but you have a task to complete before you can attain it. Revenge. Revenge is sweet, but only if you can accomplish it. Otherwise it consumes you and you become worthless. You cannot achieve this without my help. That is why you are here now. I will provide the implement for your revenge, but you must strengthen it. Interesting. It is interesting, also kind of creepish, and something that is kind of enticing to listen to for some reason, which is kind of scary and effective, I must say. Is that the only book upon these here walls? By walls, I mean table. Well, it's the only book, but they're still readable. Ivan, it has been reported to me that our assassin was discovered and killed by the guards at the Snowdrop Inn. I told you to send one of our best men, but you thought you knew more than I and sent a novice instead. We can't afford such mistakes at a time like this. The Dragon Order has located Dracula's amulet, and someone is already on his way here with it. Why did you think I ordered this action? I am trying to learn this emissary's identity from the villagers, but we can't wait. You must immediately send three more assassins to deal with him. Lord Kajavas. I fear that's too late, old buddy, old sir. I fear it is too late. When I say fear... Hello? I mean, I'm pleased. Oh, look! Marble that doesn't look like marble. Hey, it's a doom face. That's pretty hilarious looking. I shall find thee. Thou canst not have gone far. Man, these demons are like... I'm trying to frown to look evil, but their frowns look exaggerated. And, and, uh, and, uh, and they're all like, frowning a lot, and they just kind of look like they're faking it, and I'm just like, come on, every pony smile. But anyways, that guy's more like a goat than a horse, but hey. Right. Eleven mosses, eh? Okay, then. <laughs> Let's stand on the soapbox and friggin' you cannot escape the inevitable. Your fate, uh... If, if by the inevitable you mean I am going to knock you out and not even care, then yeah, I, I cannot nor do I really want to escape it, but that blood cannot escape being on the floor either, so whatever. I notice I don't use tools very much other than water arrows and, and stuff in the, uh, in the game. You're supposed to use moss and I barely even ever check if I have any, so I guess some people are calling me not a good player, but... Honestly, who cares? Oh, hey. But then some people would say that use of items is not good and I should ghost, but then ghosting is, like, really not interesting unless you're there specifically to see the ghosting, like, to see how it's done, in which case, yeah, it is, but then even then, you, you'd you probably want to skip around a bit still, but, oh well. I want a map, you know what? I want a map. I'm gonna scream and cry like a small toddler until I get a map, but what are, are there any other... Well, there's that way down there. Okay, maybe I don't get a map. Well, and I probably do. I have... I have got one all the times thus far, and, uh... <laughs> yes. Somebody heard me from some other floor. Well, I could I could reload and that's reloading or and still have being able to sneak around people or I could 
take these guys out and go with the flow and destroy the challenge. I mean, I don't know. This, this is this both. Yeah, this feels pretty cheap to me, if you ask me. I feel like the less cheap option is really to reload. I mean, come on. But I don't know how far back I am, so that was a bad idea. Well, maybe not. Right. So instead of just running down like an imbecile, I will instead crawl down like a guy with no legs. Why are they looking? Or are they just walking? Because I haven't made any noise on this marble. Come on now. Oh, they're just walking. Okay, fine. Five. I don't want to waste those on those. Oh, they have good sight. Fantastic. How many guards? Yeah, Garrett, how many guards do they have? Christ. Maybe I will use waters. Yeah, never mind. Never mind. <sighs> well, maybe I'll just sort of look over this way a bit and that would be an entertainment -ing sort of thing sort of thing to do. And maybe if I go down, I'll probably be able to come out through that room through another path and have a better chance of not sucking. Wait a minute, what's well, I guess those guys are worshipping a big old statue. That <laughs> that's actually semi-normal thing to worship, I guess, maybe. The winds are not at peace. No, indeed. Is this a vision? Earth is this a vision? That's what Earth does at visions is this is this. Come on! What does this say? It doesn't say anything. Well, there's a ladder. If I climb up, I'm certainly going to be seen by that dude. I wish I had a map so I could know where the goddamn hell I was going, because this place has got a lot of paths, though. And obviously, as you all know by now, those things kill my brain. Paths, I mean, stuff. Anyways, I suppose I could just rush it. Oh, wait. Armory! Well, can I get in? Or... No, no, I can't. Our sanctum is invaded. Yeah, it sure is. Unfortunately. <sighs> Light reveals Stupid running to get on. guards and then they'll all follow me. Then you can what the deal? Why is this guy always here? Be still. Don't be an asshole. Don't be an asshole. You cannot change my destiny. Oh. Shut up! I'm changing your destiny already, God. <coughs> Come on! You can Alright, I killed him. Pretty easily, in fact. It's pretty freaking hilarious. I want to try that. Now that I know I can, I can throw out candles. One. Okay, well, there's the key I want for that side, I suppose. Uh-oh. Good! Fine! So now there's this. That's friggin' amazing. I guess one of these doors will lead me into that big room of guards, which is just a guess, but... Yeah. Here we are. Yes. How many guards do they have in here, anyway? I know, right? They totally have too many. Yeah, this is sort of different, isn't it? Well, I only just noticed it now, but some other dude, he's like, this mission seems quite Walls have different been from free. the others. And I said I wouldn't be cheap, but I mean, I don't like to walk on this marbly floor with uh, all these guards around. But I uh, moss arrows. Uh, moss arrows. I should use moss arrows. I keep forgetting. <laughs> I'm, I'm reloading it if I find a way. To not be cheap, but then they just hear the mosses, which is the stupidest thing ever, because the point of mosses is they're silent. Dumb to hear them being shot. I don't know, man. I guess I can't, I guess... I'm supposed to just... I guess I'm supposed to just take a bunch of guys out, really. I mean, it seems like... It, it seems like the obvious intent here, seeing as they're so twitchy, and... They hear mosses. And there's a lot of them, and Garrett comments that there's a lot of them, so... Oh, well. Come on, you guys, don't make me wait all day. Come on! Don't you! Idiot. Idiot, sir! Very annoying! God, let's just have guards stand on marble floors. That sounds like great gameplay. Dur her. Boy, let's have him twitchy like an idiot. Whoa, whoa, whoa. God, there must be a better way for me to deal with those guys. That doesn't look very... None of these places look interesting. I'm gonna climb this ladder, because at least that looks moderately different than usual, for Christ's sake. Oh, I 
The shadows hold the threat. Good lord. I wonder if these guys are all twitchy because I let those other guys run. Their AI routines of twitchiness Hello? before. And now everybody in the level cares about me or something. Damn! Our assassin was discovered and killed by the guards at the end. I need to inform Lokan's FS about this. Oh, really? Hey, I can turn the telescope all the way around and look beneath it and above <laughs> it. <laughs> it's it's actually just like a view camera that's up on a cliff, but it isn't because it's literally hanging in midair. This is... <laughs> oh, wait. Looks like I might be able to climb onto the roof. Okay, at least that's... semi-helpful. God. I don't know if I like this level as much as the others. You know? It just feels a bit... not quite as polished or something. Just a little bit more... Annoying for no reason. Let's no. Reveal your cowardice, intruder. I have you found an intruder among us. Us. I don't even get any tools. No flash bombs or anything. Not very many arrows either. Well, whatever. <gasps> This is a, this is a blackjack mission. It just you cannot change my obvious. destiny, thief. Stop turning you, around. You, I'm gonna you kill you with a blackjack. It's gonna be not interesting gameplay at all. Hey, I guess I really did KO him properly that one time instead of killing. That's that's weird. You cannot change my destiny. Come on, asshole. Yeah, that thing looks like a telescope pointing that way, but it's like a camera to a floating camera in midair. It just doesn't make any sense. Good lord. Well, I think I want to be on top of that, but... <laughs> okay. Climb onto the roof. Is that thee? For fuck's sake, who's saying that? Just because, just because Garrett acknowledges the fact that there's a lot of guards, it doesn't at all mean that you can say LOL, let's just put them there, is not fun or anything, but we can have it pointed out and that'll make it okay. Well, no. Aye. Also, this is a pretty tricky sort of a shot, I guess. Someone I'll be on my way. <sighs> yeah, and I can't even... <sighs> Well, do I want to get under the roof from here? Like, why can't I just climb up the stairs to the roof? Uh, I don't know, so instead I'm going to go in this room. Jeez. <laughs> this is my commentary when I'm kind of feeling not at my best. It's amazing. Well, no, it isn't. It's the opposite of amazing, but at least it's decent. And <laughs> decent is something we can all get behind, I suppose. Unless we have very high standards, such as myself. Oh, man. I guess it's really just a sort of an armory, and I was complaining about not having tools, and yet, here they were. Right here, except still no uh, flash bombs or anything, but... Oh, well. You can't always have nothing, everything, something, can ya? Well, might as well have some fun. I'm obviously being given weapons of lethal implement, so I'm gonna use them. It would be wise to surrender. Man, they still haven't calmed down enough to be killed by one arrow. Hey, what is wrong with you? Friggin' stupid. Take that many arrows to die? Even then they don't let me have any fun. God. I hate those rooms so much I'm gonna go upstairs instead. And it's probably gonna be even worse up there, but hey. Oh well. Can't go this way. Ah. <sighs> What if I can get up in here? Come on, jump, Garrett, jump! <sighs> ah. No, but it's just outside again. Fantastic. What about this room over here? Doesn't really look any friendlier, but, uh, oh well. Let's have a drink and state how tough times are. What? Your, your wounds? Your molds? Your moans? <laughs> your mom? Are not at peace. Yeah. 
Yeah. There's an ancient druid saying, a man who would save others must first save himself. All right, prepare to have everybody alerted because I do not belong here. I hate that stupid knockout stim where they, whatever it is, where they, uh, it's so weird. Like you really, you can't sneak through it very well, and they give you weapons of destruction, which means they want you to fight. And if you blackjack, everybody gets alerted. I promise thee a good. You promised me a goodly fight. You didn't give it to me. You're a promise breaker, and I'm gonna have to chase you in a wagon. God. Well. Instead of making me search for all these parts, they instead give them to me right away. Oh, there's the portico, which I don't know what that is. There's a key which I might be able to use in that one place. <laughs> which, uh, I don't know if I remember. I should probably stop soon because my my voice, uh, well not my voice, my words are getting to be just kind of annoyed and not really saying much. But I suppose I'll open these chests first. Yep, it's definitely a fighting mission here. Wow. But it's so conflicting, because maybe they maybe they want to give me all the tools so that I can go at it the way I want, but the moss arrows are still guards hear moss arrows. Did the dude realize that the guards being sensitive would make them hear mosses, thus defeating the purpose of using them? Or or what? I I don't really get this mission, no, I don't get it at all. Portico. Portico. And of course, it's the old one door. What's so weird? Like, did the guy not know how to link doors or something? I, mean, I don't know. I mean, that seems like a common thing. Like, oh, it's just outside. God. Like, I don't know much about that. Oh, wait. Okay, well, never mind that door. And what? Now I can highlight that? But not if I'm too close. So weird. Anyways, that'll be all for today. I guess this is a key thing. Maybe I can put a key here. Well, this is a throne room. I can pick that guy off with an arrow. But if I miss, I'll give myself away. It's the throne room. How pretentious can't you get? Next time, I'll go in the throne room. So, see you guys later. Bye for now.